right, so people in the region know it's coming. They're preparing as best they can. That includes in Digby, Nova Scotia, and the mayor of Digby is Ben Cleveland. He joins me now. Ben, thanks for taking the time. I know it's got to be very busy, but we appreciate you coming on CTV. What's happening in your community right now? Well, well, right now it's a beautiful sunny day, but the wind is starting to pick up. Yes, we've been preparing for the last week when we could see that the storm was going to hit us. So uh, lots of activity, lots of people being activated. The local EMO center is activated. The provincial one is activated. And uh, there'll be lots of boots on the ground over the next 48 hours. Yeah, people are watching across the country. We just want to show a map if we can, Ben, just to pinpoint exactly where Digby is so people can get a sense of, of where you are coming to us from. We can see Digby there uh, in southwestern Nova Scotia. You're you know, north of Yarmouth, of course. Uh, so the number one challenge you guys are facing, what are you, what are you the most concerned about right now, Ben? Well, if there's a, a blessing, it's, a, it's warm. So we don't have concerns about the weather, but it will be the power outage, but it will also trying to convince people don't go sightseeing on the shorelines. It's a, it's amazing to see those uh, large waves coming in, but stay away from the shoreline because that's where the most risk is probably going to be now. And what are you hearing from residents? And no doubt people have been reaching out to you. You've been talking to people as well. People are concerned about the power outages. People are concerned about way that, where they may have to go. Uh, if there's a long-term uh, power outage in the area. But we have uh, local shelters that will be opened up if necessary. We encourage people not to go out looking for those during the middle of the storm. That's the most dangerous time to go. Uh, stay home for 72 hours. Uh, the centers will be open, and we'll get the word out uh, that they're there. And uh, and uh, just But just stay home. Just stay home and uh, bear it out, the most dangerous place to be is outside in the weather. We were bringing our viewers a live news conference, Ben, last hour from, uh, you know, officials in Nova Scotia about, you know, all the preparations underway. And one of the things they talked about was access to cell phone services and making sure that the cell phones, those towers and cell phone access is still able to be maintained. Is, is that a concern? It always is. So uh, cell phones, uh, the technology does have backup power. They do have generators to go around. But we'll be putting the word out through cell phones, uh, alerts, social media, 211 on the phone lines. But we're a small community, so we can get people out going door to door if necessary to let people know uh, what is happening in their community. Ben Cleveland is the mayor of Digby, Nova Scotia, one of the areas that's bracing for impact ahead of Hurricane Lee. Thanks for this. So much appreciated, Ben, and all the best. Keep in touch with us if you can. We're a hearty bunch here. Mm, I know you are. Thank you.